this is the quick menu button setup window uh, in here you can set up buttons that you can use to sell quickly in your business with um, this is just an added option added benefit uh, to the standard selling through uh, scanning items with a barcode scanner or selling through manually typing on the keyboard the item and IDs which of course you can still do all of those things with our software this is just an added option added benefit you can set up buttons on your main screen of the software and uh, each button will represent one item you push the button and uh, you're selling um, it's important to mention that you can add an unlimited uh, amount of buttons even though of course an unlimited amount of buttons or a very large amount of buttons will not uh, all fit at once in this area that we have designated for these buttons uh, that's why we have um, two um, little forward and little back button that will show up on each side of these buttons and uh, you can toggle between full pages of buttons you know kinda like listing uh, pages on a book uh, and that's how you achieve uh, to go through many many buttons as many as you have uh, the need to create and they're of course uh, well categorized in different categories that we call submenus so you create also buttons for categories or submenus so you click on a button that represents a category and you get only those buttons that uh, fit in that category and uh, you s get to your buttons easier like that and you uh, click on another category and you get displayed only the buttons from that category and it's easier to work more organized that way so now we'll show you an example of how you can create some uh, quick menu buttons uh, which could also have pictures if you choose to uh, use pictures in them but please understand this is totally optional you can just create uh, buttons without pictures and um, first of course we'll create a sub menu button or a category button so these uh, quick menu buttons have somewhere to belong to a category to belong to and uh, please keep in mind that as we're selecting these um, pictures for these buttons in our case uh, you'll see us go through different folders and files that represent these pictures uh, please keep in mind that uh, you know we're just using these pictures in here for uh, demonstration purposes and we are not distributing any pictures we don't have the rights to distribute any pictures uh, to you or other users uh, you're ultimately responsible for providing your own pictures either finding your own pictures or creating your own pictures of your own unique items in your own business so you will definitely not see the same folders and files for browsing pictures that we show you in here at your computer at your business Now it's important to understand that in order to create a quick menu button that will be fun functional you also have to have a corresponding item ID for that button in, uh, in inventory. Uh, to be more precise the name of the button has to be exactly according to the item ID in your inventory. So uh, you know if your case is like ours is right now we're just starting off and our inventory is empty we haven't created any items in inventory you can still create the buttons that we will, as we will create them right now uh, and you can then just later remember to add those items in inventory so these buttons can become functional so they actually have something to point to and correspond to in inventory otherwise they will not be functional we'll now create some buttons uh, as an example for some drinks for some soft drinks and uh, we'll be using some pictures for them again keep in mind that the pictures are totally optional you can just create buttons without pictures in your business made a little error in here but that's good you can see what's going on is the software is telling us that we have to create at least one sub menu button one category button first so that this quick button that we're trying to create has somewhere to actually belong to it has at least one category to belong to so we'll go ahead and add a sub menu button real quick
So now we're going to go ahead and attempt again to add our quick menu button. And there's our quick menu button. We'll create a few more. We set soft drinks, right? get the idea so I'll speed this up a little bit and one more all right so we've created some buttons to start with in here for an example and one uh, sub menu or category I'll show you how that looks like on the main screen right now here are the buttons of our products and uh, as I said there'll be a toggle button for forward and one for back so you can uh, toggle between pages of buttons if you have created uh, more buttons that can fit at once on the screen and below them are the category buttons or the sub menu buttons as we call them right now we just have soft drinks which these belong to uh, but we could create multiple of course uh, unlimited amount of these category buttons or categories and if there is uh, more than can fit at once on the screen then you use these toggle buttons this is the forward and the back button so please watch the next uh, video tutorial that's uh, continuance to this one it's actually a two-part video tutorial this one uh, where we will reveal some other things you need to know about these buttons